how to check your messages and also how to update your email address at NVC Computer Electronic Application Center. If you want to know something about it, just stay tuned and I'll be right back. USA Mundo. Hello everybody, this is John from USA Mundo. Welcome back and thanks for watching. If it's your first time on my channel, as always, welcome. Today I have another video for you guys on, like I said in the introduction, if you want to know how to check your messages on uh, the computer electronic application center and also how to uh, update your email address and uh, this video is for you okay so when your case move to nvc national visa center and um, they send you a welcome letter with your uh, case uh, number and invoice id uh, you can log into the computer electronic application center okay so there uh, you can do a lot of stuff you know pay fees and uh, submit document but you know some of you guys send me a uh, uh, question uh, regarding how to update uh, their email uh, address and then also how to check on uh, uh, their messages uh, at mvc computer electronic application center okay so if you are really let's go in front of my computer so i can show you exactly on uh, where to uh, uh, check your messages and also where to update your email address So to check the uh, messages uh, NVC sends you and also to um, update your email information, um, what you're gonna do is to log into the Computer Electronic Application Center. Okay, so to do that, you have to click on the, the link. If you receive the welcome letter yet, you know, uh, I'm assuming uh, you, you already received uh, the welcome letter and then from on the welcome letter, you will have the link uh, you're going to use to log into the Computer Electronic Application Center. You can also Google how to log into the Computer Electronic Application Center. And then from there, once you click on the link, you will see this page where you're going to provide your case number. Okay, the case number also will be in your on your um, in your welcome letter and also the uh, invoice ID on which on which you're going to use to log into the Computer Electronic Application Center. Okay, so here you provide a case number and then you click continue and it will ask you for your invoice ID and then you uh, provide the invoice ID name from there you can uh, log into the account okay so once you need to uh, log into the account it's gonna look like this okay now okay you, as you can see here you will see on um, uh, choice of address and agent and fees on uh, um, uh, immigrant visa application and document and also you see your, your case number here on top okay and then the visa uh, class like what type of visa if it's on uh, CR1 or F28 whatever you see here uh, your case is currently on uh, NVC, so reason why you can log into the Computer Electronic Application Center. And then the foreign state, uh, in this case, is on uh, Angola. And then the uh, interview location will be Casablanca, because you have to choose on where the intended immigrant will go for interview, okay, on uh, what, what city and, uh, and state. And then the priority date, as you can see here. And then from here, to check the messages, uh, all you got to do is when you scroll down a little bit, you will see on, on messages okay so these are the messages uh, you receive from nvc these are the total messages as you can see it's 26 and then the new messages are 12 so to click on the new messages so just click on this one or click on view messages and then you see those messages and then you see what nvc on uh, what uh, those messages uh, are about okay and then um from there you know you check all your messages it's very important to uh, check your message because uh, even though nvc send uh, the message to your email it's easy to just check or notice that, uh, that you receive uh, a new messages here that's why it's very important to log into the computer electronic application center your uh, uh, nvc account uh, frequently you know that way you don't miss anything so in case you want to change your email address what you're going to do when you scroll down a little bit you're going to see here you see on uh, email address and then to uh, change your email address on uh, um, all you got to do is to click edit and then from there you provide a new email address you want to use make sure the email address you provide is on uh, email address uh, your email address or email address of uh, somebody you trust because what's going to happen is uh, once you provide those email address or the email address then nvc will send a uh, notification to that email address so if you don't trust that person guess what uh, it can be harmful that person can use that against you so make sure whoever e uh, email address you provide is somebody you trust and also on top of that provide your email address uh, as well so basically this is how you check your messages and uh, update uh, your email address uh, uh, NVC computer electronic application center because some of you guys been sending me a message so I know how to uh, edit or uh, update your email address so now 
uh, here you have it you know that this is how you you do it that's it for today's video i hope you guys love it learn something from me. if you know somebody who needs to watch this video please share with that person if you like the video hit the like button if you want to see more video like this one all you gotta do is click on this once again my name is john thanks for watching and i'll talk to you guys in the next video USA Monday.